Well, prices only seem to be going up at the grocery store. A new report showing wholesale inflation rose more than expected in January. That's a measure of inflation based on the price of goods before they reach consumers. Earlier this week, another report showed grocery prices rose nearly half a percent from December to January. News for Tax reporter Khalil Maycock spoke with shoppers about how this is affecting their wallets. Prices are just, we're so accustomed to it though, it's, it's gone up. Phyllis Hoskins is describing the price of groceries. We caught up with her and others as they were leaving the store, talking with them about how much they spend. When you go grocery shopping, what is your bill like? <laughs> it, it depends. Um, if I'm grocery shopping for just basic household stuff, my grocery bill can be, hell, it's never $20. It's anywhere from $50 to $200. Hoskins and the lady I just introduced you to both say they feel like their bill has increased the past few months, and they're not wrong. According to this report from the U.S. Department of Labor released this week, grocery prices rose 0.4 percent from December to January. The report details how the index for meats and eggs didn't change over that month period, but the index for sugar, sweets, fats and oils did. One shopper we spoke with says the way she tries to navigate the price increase is by never shopping at the same store all of the time. And that's to get savings. So I wanted to try her method by going to these three grocery stores to compare prices. This is the list of five things I looked at. A five pound bag of apples, chicken thighs, a gallon of milk, a dozen large eggs, and a loaf of white bread. At Harvey's, those five items cost $24.75. At Publix, they cost $25.26. And at Walmart, it costs $17.39. And Hoskins says even though prices are rising, they're just something we all have to deal with. So if you want to eat, you're going to pay the prices. And that report also says groceries over the last year rose 1.2%. Mm -hmm. So you, you tried that customer's method, that it viewer's did. method. Love it. Uh, what are some of the uh, words of wisdom that we might pull from uh, experts when it comes to trying to save mo money on Okay, so habits? experts say when you are grocery shopping, go to those different stores to find those different prices. Also, it's important to make sure you look through different items like these when you go to grocery store to see what's on sale as well as couponing. I know I did look at uh, Publix's couponing. They have 50 cents off chicken wings. Hmm. if you wanted to buy those. Okay. And I'm not a couponer, but I'm like, I might want to start after this. After that. And I love the experiment you did. Thank you. Yeah, it was good. It opened our eyes. All right.